Hi, I'm Dan Assard. This short video is part of the rollout to the members of the Independent Funeral Directors of Florida for the most unique association program. It's called I Succession. In the one previous video, I tried to give you an overview of what the IFDF is rolling out to its members. This video will be more about the why. Why is it important for you to take advantage of this? iSuccession was created to help the IFDF members with one of the most important decisions of their lifetime, their business succession. iSuccession is a personalized approach. It's intended to help the members of IFDF be prepared for the day when they will transfer their ownership of their business. Every business will be transferred. It'll either be during your lifetime or upon your death. Without regard of whoever you wish to desire to transfer your business to, or whenever you want to be independent of your business, you need to have confidence that you're going to walk away with enough money. My Uncle Murray used to tell me, Danya, whether you're rich or poor, it's always good to have money. You've worked very hard in your chosen profession. You have helped many people at very difficult times in their lives. You took financial risk by being a business owner. There's a time that you or your stakeholders need to be able to convert that business to cash. The objective at that time is to make sure that you have enough money to be financially independent of your business. By you answering a few questions, we can determine whether you will have enough money to be financially independent. Keep in mind, this is an estimate. Nothing is guaranteed. And many things could upset the calculation. But you have to start somewhere and you have to start now. In a financial plan, there's a time when we have human beings at work and ideally a time when we have money at work. If all goes according to plan, you should not outlive your money. When most non-business owners think about retirement, they think about an income. Most see that income as being a flat amount each year. To me, retirement income is about buying power. A flat amount of income each year actually reduces your buying power each year due to inflation. But if we focus on the concept of maintaining your buying power, that means year after year, you should have more income coming in and that sustains your buying power. As part of the I succession planning, we will estimate how much money you need to have to maintain that buying power for your lifetime. There are four phases to a good retirement plan scenario. Phase one is the funding phase. This is the time, probably now for you, that you're putting money aside for your future, that your assets are growing for your future, that hopefully your business is growing in value. Phase two is the event of liquidating that business or your business succession plan. This is when the business transfer takes place to whoever you choose. 
Phase three is hopefully the longest of the four phases. It's called the retirement phase. Phase four, well, don't really worry about it because you won't be there. That's the survivorship phase. This is after your death, and this is when your plan to provide for your loved ones takes place. The mathematics of financial independence calculation requires that we look at six factors. First, what is your normal standard of living? Second, what is the estimated inflation rate affecting your future consumption? Third, how long are you going to live? Calculation number four is the amount of assets under your control. Five is the assets not under your control, such as Social Security. Sixth is the rate that you plan on having your money invested at. How much risk are you willing to take? In future videos, I'm going to continue to lay out the benefits and solutions provided by iSuccession. Drop me a note, call me, email if you have any questions.